Hello all, welcome to the CodeNest. In this tutorial, we will learn how to develop a stacked recycler view. So let's see the demo first. So this is a stacked recycler view. With the help of this, we are able to manage uh, our images uh, with the different heights. You can see that. So let's get started. Start a new Android project. So uh, first of all uh, I will add a recycler view, first add its dependency. Now I will add a recycler view. Let's give it to the ID Recycler. Okay. Now uh, let's add the model class. In this class, uh, I am taking only images, so Let's create a constructor and get a setter. Here uh, I am uh, taking images as an integer because uh, I will I will add the images file from the uh, drawable folder. So here I have already downloaded some images. Let's copy it to the drawable folder. So uh, our uh, our model class is ready. So next move to the next part. I will create now a adapter class. Adapter class uh, works as a uh, bridge between uh, our data and the UI. So I will extend the recycler view. Dot adapter. So our adapter is here is data adapter. And I will create a view model which is called data view model. 
data view holder sorry which extend recycler view holder let's create a constructor for this and also let's create a context and a data list for our model class which is data now we will create a constructor for data adapter class and then we will implement the recycler view methods so there are three methods on create on bind view holder and get item counts in the get item count data lets dot size now first of all we will create a recycler view row item let's say data row item Now uh, let's go to the adapter class and here we will set the data row item layout. Layout in Flutter dot from context dot inflate r dot layout dot row item data row item from a parent from a false now uh, on create view holder return a data view holder with view now in the dot data row item let we have only one image view so image view item view dot find view by id now we will set this image in on bind view holder so holder dot item image view dot set image resources we will take a data from array list dot get position get image now let's uh, move to the main 
activity from there we will set our recycler view and data adapter so first here we will take the recycler view and our adapter class Now here we will take a list of our model class for adding data. Type of array list. Now in this data list we will add data. Similarly, we have we are going to add all these images like here we have one, two, three, four, nine images. Now uh, we will set the stacked grid layout manager to the recycler view. Recycler view dot layout manager. Let's say uh, we want three columns. Vertical recycler view. Now we will set this layout manager in recycler view. Recycler view dot set layout manager. Layout manager. Now we will set the uh, this data list to our adapter class. So data adapter equal to new data adapter class. Data 
legs bulandi sir here you can see that all the images here but not in a proper view so let's add some more images i will copy and paste again this let's go to the data row item and here uh, there is a property called view bound this set to true and we will set also padding say a db select run again this app now you can see that this look cool now uh, to make it more beautiful uh, i am going to add in this uh, one thing more uh, is the card view so that uh, uh, i can set the uh, radius of the corner of the images so Let's remove the padding from here and set it to card view. And also set the radius. Let's say five dp. Let's run again. now you can see that here uh, we have the rounded rounded corner in each of the images so uh, this is all about stacked recycler view which help us to manage uh, our uh, dynamic images uh, which having the different sides so if you have any questions uh, and any doubt you can comment on the comment box please like share and subscribe see you in the next tutorial